Hi, Pat Engineer here for Wink Sound. Today, I'll be going over Pro Tools shortcuts. Let's go for editing. Tab to transients is a feature I use a lot. You want to make sure it's enabled. It's this blue box that says Tab to transients. You're going to want to make sure keyboard focus is on, which is this little area right here. If I hold Tab, it'll take me to the next transient. If I hold Option Tab, it takes me the other way. So if I hold Shift and Tab, it highlights this whole section. Even though it looks like this tiny area is sticking out, if I use T to zoom in all the way, you'll see that there's actually nothing that's out. Shift Option Tab, it takes me the other way. Shift Control Minus on the Alpha keypad, which is the minus above the P, will show your clip gain line. If I hold B, it'll separate the region. Say you cut it up and you're like, oh, I wish I hadn't done that for whatever reason. Highlight it, Command H, it's called Hill Separation, Hills the region right up. Shift Control Plus, the clip gain info pops up and down, which is this little fader down here. Escape shuttles through all your tools. This is a smart tool. With the smart tool, if you're above the middle of the clip, it's a selector tool. If you're below, it's a grabber. If you're in the middle, it's a trim tool for clip gain info. And if you're all the way to the left, it's also a trimmer tool. F1, F2, F3, and F4 are your quick keys for your edit mode. F1 is shuffle. F2 is slip. F3 is spot. F4 is grid. If you hit F4 again, it does relative grid. If you have any questions, hit me up on Twitter, at Panda Engineer. Join the conversation by following Wink Sound on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube to keep up with everything you need to know about music and audio technology.